Hey guys, and welcome to The Witcher 3. As you may know from one of my update videos, I believe it was with the Assassin's Creed Odyssey playthrough, I did let you know that I have in fact played The Witcher 3. I played it immediately upon finishing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. It took me 78 hours to complete The Witcher, and that's including all the DLCs. At first I played it kind of trying to get through most of the quests. I didn't do all of them by any means, especially not all the contracts. In fact, I think to an extent I pretty much ignored contracts throughout the entire game. Whoops. So, and then towards the middle and the end, I kind of rushed through it because I, kind of, I wanted Geralt and Ciri to finally hurry up and meet because that's like the driving force of the game. And so I'm like, okay, I need to keep going, I need to keep going, I need to keep going. And so I eventually stopped kind of doing the side plots the further I got into the game and just fo focused on the main plot line. So this time around, I'd like to focus more on the side plots as well as the main plots. I'm probably just gonna skip through doing all the extra little side content that's not even quest based, just like, you know, killing an animal nest and, or going to this hidden treasure. You guys don't really need to see that because that's kind of boring. So I'll, I'll do it, but cut it out. So you guys are only gonna see all the quest based content. Uh, in case you didn't notice, I absolutely love this game. It's why I'm playing it again. I, even though it was back in October that I played it, there's a lot of stuff I don't remember about the game because I played it so quickly and I don't think I've retained a lot of that information because I went through it so quickly so I'm looking forward to re-educating myself on many parts of this game. So we will start a new game. I want everything and a basic difficulty. Sure, give us tutorials. Sure, why not? It's a bit loud. Wow, you need to talk to your barber about your hair, buddy. Because it's, it's doing strange things. Ugh! I forgot how gruesome this game can be. Oh sure, let's just touch the horse's blood. I find it weird how in this cutscene they don't actually look correct. Like, that's not what Geralt looks like. Ah, that's Yen. Yeah, that's not what Yen looks like either. Ew. Ew. That's a really strong crow. Really gross crow. So we're hunting Yen. I vaguely recall this. Ooh. Ow. She actually looks quite old in this cutscene. Which is not what you want. Uh huh, she's doing all of this in heels, guys, apparently. She's magical, alright. Why is she standing in the middle of a battlefield? I don't understand. Seems like a sure way to die, or at the very least get hurt. Definitely doesn't look like Yen. I know it's her, I'm just meaning like the graphics wise, it does not look like her. She has some kick ass abilities. Poor horsies. It's not their fault. Bye! <laughs> nice knowing ya! So she favoured one side of the army of the other. Oh, we're taking somebody else's horse. A war horse. Brilliant. Nice lighting though. Oh, so it was a magical crow. Good hunters and trackers if they can uh, track down a witch. Oh, sorcerer, whatever she is, sorceress. Oh, 
that's right, we start in a memory or something, don't we? Yeah, I remember this. Kermohan, which you keep, banks of the Gwenlak. Is that really necessary, Geralt? Oh, that is creepy. Ugh. Yep, he not a fan. You know I don't find that amusing. Can you imagine having that thing on you? Ugh. Oh, as you do. Sure. It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday already. You promised Siri you'd train with her. Go before Vesemir bores her to death with those etchings. Damn, he's been through a lot. And they're all claw marks for the most part, actually, because they're all like triple or double scratches in the same lines, which means it was claws. So I suppose he's a witcher. Later then. Mm. See you later. Wow, she just doesn't even care. Thanks, Ian. Appreciate it. Oh, there we go. That's more like it. Does her hair magically go all curly like that? Ooh, nice lingerie. No one's hair does that. Perfect spirals. Jealous. I might just turn the volume down a little bit. Oh my god, what? Okay, that was weird. My game sort of just CTD'd, but that's okay. We've just started again. <laughs> Welcome to the tutorial. Welcome to The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. How polite, thank you. This tutorial will introduce the game's core elements. Each message will be saved in the glossary. We will also find detailed information about world lore and gameplay mechanics. To disable tutorial messages, go to the options menu. No, I mean, I need to refresh a course on how to play this game, so that is absolutely A-OK. -okay. I'm also just going to point out, uh, in, I'm using a controller. I know I am playing on PC, but I tried to use a keyboard and mouse the first time I played this game and I just struggled immensely with the key bindings. They weren't very intuitive, it was very difficult to get used to them. So I ended up using a controller and I have to say I, I still am not a fan of the controller either because a lot of the controls are still very clunky and the way he moves um, is very clunky. Like he takes a while to stop after you stop moving and he doesn't really often go in the direction you want him to go in. This I remember from when I played it last time. So I'll see if I can ignore these effects as I play, but I do remember them being a little frustrating. But I don't let that discount the game. I love the game to bits. It is just absolutely sensational. But the reason I bring this up is because in the bottom right hand corner, it's currently showing the PlayStation 4 configuration, which is good. But often throughout the game, that will change and it will show the Xbox controller configuration and I don't know why. So if I forget the keys, I I can't even use the little cheat sheet in the corner to get the correct keys because it often tells me the wrong controller buttons and I don't really know the buttons on an Xbox controller because I try to ignore Xbox to the best of my ability. So just gonna let you know that that will happen at some point in time. Anyway, we've rotated the camera, that's great. Kermohan, use a witch's senses to find the key to the bedroom door. Who locks the bedroom door from the inside with a key and doesn't leave the key in the lock? Very strange. Witch's senses hold L2. Okay, this is bringing back memories for sure. Okay, apparently we need to go on the other side of this chair. Examine. You're running out of juice. I know. You might bring me some more once you're done training. She likes her juice? God, he fit in that tub. It looks a little small, don't you think? I think it looks small. Ah, uh, you know, we won't extinguish that lantern, that lamp, candles, candelabra. God, we'll get the right word in the end. 
We'll leave a light side. Just, hey, Yen. How are things going? God. See, I thought Siri could stand to wait a little longer. It's uninstructive. Not to mention unreasonable. Want to stay with you a little longer? Let's be unreasonable. No, no, you're right. <sighs> yeah, better go see Siri. Go and train with her, then come back. It'll give me a chance to put my face on. <laughs> it's funny that's how I phrase it as well. <laughs> does that before? You've known many. What's it matter? Only ever thought of you. Oh, that's so sweet. Sometimes I don't expect sweetness from Geralt, and then you just get it all of a sudden. It's like, bam! Oh, why is this glistening red? Got any clothes that aren't black or white? I know, right? Undergarments. <laughs> she dresses like a magpie. But your undergarments... Okay, I can't zoom in any close-up. But yeah, they were black and white, weren't they? They were black and grey. Anything in this corner? Just a candelabra. Is she humming? Ooh, what's this? Ah, I'll look at perfume Lilac model. And gooseberries, of course. Oh yes, Herald, of course. Stop fingering my toilet. <laughs> uh, sometimes she reminds me of myself. I would have said fondling, stop fondling my toiletries, but you know, same principle applies. Why is the keys just sitting on a book? Okay. Wait. <laughs> Hold on a second. I was over here where I collected the key and I was just reading the instructions and it said to unlock a door, press X. So I just hit it from here. And look at that! It unlocks, and I'm like three meters away from the door. That is hilarious. Okay, we'll take that in a second. What's happening out here? Oh my god, Shit. check out that view. Pass as beautiful as ever. I know, right? Look at it. Holy crap. It reminds me of Skyhold a little bit, I won't lie. Oh my god, it's beautiful. Bloody windy, as you'd expect. Oh, that tower is not looking like it's in good condition. What is that? Oh, it's Siri training. That's what I can hear. Hey Siri! Oh, I love Siri. One of my favorite characters. God, it's gonna be so long until we get to meet her. Oh, I can't sprint? Wait, that's not even sprint. I don't even know what that is. I remember that sprint isn't clicking down L3. Which is a bit of a bitch, because like... I okay, maybe, maybe it's... I don't know. I don't know. Apparently all I can do is jump. Oh, I can't even do that because I'm in a cutscene. <laughs> Old Witcher's fast asleep. Ciri's disappeared somewhere, of course. Well, Iris saw her from the balcony. So I know where. Oh my gosh! Look at that cool chair. Look at the engravings on it. Wish I had a detailed chair like that, man. Look how pretty it is. Guess she prefers practice to theory. Hmm. Why? Time to wake up, master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too. <laughs> Damn it. Better taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls. Wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. <laughs> John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. <laughs> She's tackling the pendulums, right? Yep. That she is. How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone. It only embeds your errors. You Bring know, our young damsel wrong. to the lower courtyard. Young damsel. She wants to practice, she'll get to practice. Okay. Don't get mad at her. We've spoiled her. Eh. Don't get mad at her. Why the hell not? The whippersnapper refuses Snapper. to do as she's told. You, you like fell asleep. <laughs> Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame. But this has to end. Now. Okay. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that if she is to become one of us. I mean, if she wants to have see fun below. with it, why not? I mean, it doesn't have to be all doom and gloom, you know. Doesn't she do this blindfolded or something? Yeah, she is. Wrong. Damn, she's insane. <laughs> Now I see why you were so eager to practice. Strike. She's so flourishy. How does one do that while blindfolded? It's insane. Oh, 
not in this circus, period. <laughs> uh. Wrong. Footwork. Enough. Get down. With a flip? What do you think? I don't like Siri's young voice. I'm just gonna put it out there. All right. I'm not the biggest Take fan of it. Take off the blindfold. You got She's work so to small. Do. Your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger. <laughs> Disobeying his instructions, unwise. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. Still. I know, and you know that's no excuse. Aww, so I'm sweet sorry. that he gets down on her level. It won't happen again. He's so awesome. Apologies not enough. Better know it. Eh. Better not. Vesemir said if it does, he'll make you eat a bowl of slugs. Ew. Salt. <laughs> Ew. I mean, at least it would dry exactly. them up if they're covered in salt. So you'd best behave. They wouldn't be as sluggy. Come on. We'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? Ugh. Um, I, I guess? Oh boy. Of course. Is a witcher school or an elven bathhouse? Dude, Elven Bathhouse, can you imagine the architecture? Join Siri and run along the ramparts down to the lower courtyard. Um, I, I can't use it while she's using it. Cirilla, I forgot that was her name. I forgot that Siri was short for anything. Um, we just... Oh, that's, that's not the right button. That's probably why nothing's happening. Oh shit, I can't get there because she's in the way! Um, where what are we going? you about breathing? Through your mouth, in rhythm with your um, steps. This way? Nope, this way, this way, this way. Yee! Who needs ladders? Siri, ladders are for plebs. <laughs> Was she just heavy breathing for the sake of breathing? Um, now where are we going? I'm a little lost, I'm not gonna lie. Um, this way? Definitely not the way. No, this is the way. This is looking fine. Ow. I missed the next step down. Oh, I don't have a recent save, but sure. I, I, I was trying to get on the platform, like, halfway down, but I missed it and went all the way down. I, I kind of injured myself. Whoops. Wow. I'm surprised yet unsurprised that I died so quickly. Oh, you can't beat her to the ladder. She has to go up for... Oh, Egypt. Go, go, go. Use the ladder. What are you doing? Are you trying to let her win? She's like miles ahead now. Oh god. Come on, Geralt. We're trying to win. Oh, Frigg. We're trying to win here. What did I so what are we doing? We're breathing. doing this. Your mouth and, and then we're turning your around. And then we were going this way. Siri, cut it out. I love that. She's just being so extra. Uh, and then we go this way. Nope, down, dead, down. Down the freaking hole. There we go. Shh! I'm trying to navigate here. I don't know where we're going. Can this get me down here? No, there's a freaking dead end. I do have to go up here. God damn it, she's gonna win at this, right? What are you doing? He's stuck on something. Shh! Oh my god. What's jump again? Okay, so jump is not uh, cross. What the hell are you doing, buddy? I don't understand. What? Why is the jump not X. That's so clunky. Okay, we've definitely lost this this race. Okay, we go this way and then this way, and then I win. <laughs> Just <laughs> by like a, a smidge. Where, where are we going here? Okay, we we won by like a meter because she stopped and waited for me. Oh my gosh. That's so odd. Why? Why is jump circle? I've never had a game where, where circles jump. If anything, it would have been a uh, square over cross X thingy. Oh, hi guys. Hey, there's a I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Does that sound sincere to you? I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the panthera tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. 
<laughs> she just did that word for word. Smooth, Siri, smooth. Still, you should have asked if... But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. Wow. She's just... Uh, A plus, Siri. A plus. Won't weasel out of this. Could have, said, could have said you did the exercise while Vesemir was asleep. Yeah. So you did the reading. Why not admit it right off? Never pounce on an advantage as soon as it appears. Wait till it stands to have maximum effect. Uncle Vesemir's words. <laughs> I need to turn the throne well, back at him. Throw in his study. face. Quick, but mischievous. She's awesome. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Siri with a dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. I mean, she's only young. How old is she here anyway? She's gotta be young. What do you think? Should she's we start by shrimp. reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Oh, I think we should review the fundamentals. Some of us don't remember the controls. Begin combat tutorial! should work on the basics. Even skilled masters need to hone the fundamentals. And Ciri's barely a novice. Draw your sword, Geralt. Oh my gosh, that is a very long uh, tutorial. Combat. Witches must be prepared to fight foes of all kinds, be they plate-clad knights, ethereal wraiths, or bone-crushing giants. To match the strengths and exploit the weaknesses of different enemies, witches need to use a variety of weapons and combat techniques. The core tools of their trade are their swords. One steel, for fighting monsters and non-humans. The other silver, for slaying monsters. Witches have also mastered a simple form of combat magic. These signs are not as powerful as the spells wielded by mages, but they can be cast very quickly with simple one-handed gestures, making them quite useful in the heat of combat. Witches are also adept in basic alchemy. They can brew powerful potions, blade oils, and bombs, all of which give them a keen advantage when fighting stronger or faster foes. I, like, never brew potions, never use blade oils, and I never use bombs. So, <laughs> alchemy is not something I usually waste my time on. I, I don't know if I will or not this playthrough, probably. I might come across strong enemies and I might need to utilize them. But, you know, in a general sense, I don't generally do that. Draw my sword. Um, press that to draw my steel sword to sheath it, hold it either way. Okay, yep. Selecting targets. Press L3 to select or deselect a target. When you have a target selected, all your attacks are directed toward it. You don't have to select a target during combat, but doing so will help you focus on a specific opponent. Bad idea. Aim One, and two, mount a fast attack. Boom! Strong Let's strike. spam that. And then you a line. strong Never attack. Suck it, Vesemir. Yeah! Footwork. Wait for Vesemir Remember. to attack. We're about to hit Siri at this rate. Dodging! To dodge to one side, indicate a direction using L and press circle. Can't catch me! Whee! Oh, we're rolling now. Okay. To roll out of the way... No. Oh, no, that's right. To roll out of the way of a blow. Choose a direction using X. Wah! Who's next? Wah! God, there was such a delay there. Harry. Yeah, terribly. Not very masterfully at all. Yeah, I get that. There's no point parrying until he attacks, right? <laughs> Did you just hear Siri? That was brilliant. What am I supposed to parry? I'm fighting a stupid dummy. Yeah, I failed that. I was busy talking. Um, so press that just before. Oh, so pretty much just do it well timed. Sucker. Yeah, I'm bad at uh, counter attacking. We can all acknowledge that. Look at the pause. It just pauses like it's giving me the opportunity to strike him. Stop running away and just act like a man. Oh, Cast the, the Quen the sign. We'll over a few witches signs. Let's start with Quen. Okay, we're opening with that. Ooh, that's, I remember these. Oh, Igni is absolutely my favorite. Um, and then Quen. Press R2. Siri, Quen is sometimes called the witch's shield. Now watch carefully to see why. It protects me against damage and certain critical effects. I never used it actually. Cast That's kind of cool. Geralt. I want to see sparks fly. I love Igni. As I said, Igni's my favorite. 
I remember Igni. Like that? Me. Ah, do you say? Ow. Back off, bruh. Time for Axie. Damn it. I hate this feeling. Okay, what's which one's Axie again? Temporarily disorient your opponents. Oh, this is the one you use in conversations, isn't it? But I wanna I wanna keep bewildering you. It's so fun. Yuridan. Oh, this is the um the ring, isn't it? I remember this one. You gotta use it against like wraiths and the, the spirity. Do wax. Slows anyone who enters its area of effect. Oh shit, he still got that shit up. Will it? Will it though? I don't think Siri was worried at all. Wow. That was epic. Siri wasn't even paying attention. She's too busy fighting her dummy. Oh, put that away, boy. Okay, he doesn't want to put the sword away. That's fine. Hold R1 and aim at one of- sorry, this is bombs aiming. At one of the highlighted training posts, then release to throw the bomb. Okay. Uh, does it have to be, like, high? Is it gonna arc? Is it just gonna go in a straight line? Okay, well, kind of arcs. The combat tutorial is now over. If you want, you can continue training with Vesemi. I- um... I mean, I could, but I, I guess nothing's really gonna help except do it in the field. To stop training, simply sheath, sheath your sword. Right. By pressing Enough. one of those. Continue training at will. No, 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 put it away. Put it away. Bye bye, helmet. Hat. Whatever it was. <laughs> Hat! Oh, that one is so sassy. <laughs> Wow, she really climbed that, but she's so short. Oh, that's gotta be an unpleasant task. Surely there's a lot of swords at Kermohan. So it's a helmet. Siri? Siri? Uh, I'll make sure to find every last blade for you. <laughs> oh, she is not gonna enjoy that at all. Now what? What the? Is that skin? What? Right, right, right. The Wild Hunt. He's so creepy. No. Uh. Bye, Siri. Sure, let's startle the poor little birdies. Maria, road to Vizima, May twelve seventy two. You all right? More or less. <laughs> Had a nightmare. About? It'd take forever to explain. Dawn, some way off. We've got time. I dreamt of Kermohan. Really rather not talk about it. I mean, Geralt's pretty stoic, but let's go with it. I started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in the tub, and next to me... Triss? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Really? Seems so real in my dream, though. How has she never been to Kaer Ka Morin? Was she about something? Kind of hmm. weird. Mm -hmm. True to life, indeed. Oh, no kidding. We'll find her. But why are we looking for her? 
We will. Not worried about that. I know we will. That's not what worries me. You've seen her tracks. She's at full gallop all the time. Breakneck speed through wildlands. I actually don't remember why. She's in a hurry to get somewhere. Or fleeing something. Either way, it means trouble of some sort. So this is my problem. She wasn't I, I don't remember chunks She's of the game. Her nose in beehives. Oh, that Courtly sounds painful. Here, mages, conspiracies there. What do you expect? Don't I don't know. remember what Yen's fleeing to or from. Once we were finally reunited, things would be calm, at least for a while. You're a witcher. Calm, calm doesn't with exist. Jennifer? <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> then we trained with Siri. In the dream, I went and found Siri. Then we trained. Those were the days. Hmm. Little she devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end well, did it? Your dream. No. The wild hunt appeared, attacked Siri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. <laughs> like a stump. It was just a dream. Was it? Was it really? Siri in my dreams might mean she's in danger. That's the problem. It was more. In the past, when Siri would appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything. It's so sweet food. that he has a connection to her. That he knows in his dreams when Siri's in danger. Oh, it's so beautiful. Be downing soon. Time to go. Wait. Yeah, what's that? What's that thing on the, the tree say? Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so. You don't even know Stop which army did it. Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Oh, how about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. Her signature scent. I'm gonna read it, not sniff it. <laughs> we must meet soon. Will it be near Vizima? Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn. Oh no. <laughs> That's private. Stop the unicorn. We used it as a bed once. Oh no. I remember. <gasps> this is terrible. Sure, let's see over Shara. Used it once or twice. Vesemir totally needs to know this. Situations. Definitely not TMI for a winter. The things young folk get up to <laughs> these days. Back on topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Very. Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Oh yeah, it would be with all the wagons and people going to and fro. <gasps> hey Roach! Wait, hear that? <laughs> Smell it. Ghouls. Ah, shit. Um, let's remember how attacking works. It's a good start. Monsters. Life on the continent and in the Skellige Isles is nasty, British and short. War lays waste to the land, and those it spares live in fear of the countless monsters lurking outside every town and village. Monsters are shown with a silver health bar above their heads, indicating that you should fight them with a silver sword. Oh! Okay. I always wondered how you know which creature to. Uh, which sword to take. Um, let me just remember. That's what I wanted. I got it, Bezimir. Is there a third? Just that? Oh no, oh no, oh no, there's another one, there's another one, there's another one. There are two more, actually, and I missed both of them. I got the skills. Oh god, wasn't fast enough. There we go. Oh my god, how many are there? Oh, I just like leapt right into it. No, not that one. Oh, I'm trying to go towards the screen. But the back button wasn't working. Adrenaline points. Sorry, sorry, I was trying to hit down and attack, but he was going forward and attacking. I was really clunky. Striking opponents generates adrenaline points. Certain abilities, adrenaline points? Oh, you mean the red. Certain abilities you can acquire allow you to perform special attacks that require and consume adrenaline points. I don't remember this at all. 
Your adrenaline points slowly decline when you are not engaged in combat. Oh, it's so the beginning of every battle. They regen. Of course. When armies Quest pass, updated. Lilac and gooseberries. Let's go before any more show up. Sure, bear with me. Vitality regeneration. You can regener ugh, regenerate vitality by eating or drinking, or by meditating for at least one hour. Oh, I remember that. I pretty much don't use food. I just meditate every single time I lose health. Note, while playing on the... Yeah, I'm not doing that. Food and drink can be placed in your consumable slots. For quick use during combat, press up or down to consume them and regenerate vitality. You have some food equipped in your upper consumable slot. Press something to eat now and generate. Regenerate a portion of your vitality. To have your horse come to you, double press L3. Only I hadn't taken damage. Roachy roach. I played this game for 79 hours, 78 hours, whatever, and I did not even realize that Roach was female. What an idiot. But Roach is apparently female. Hold up, Vesemir. Witches spend most of the time on the road in search of the next contract. They must trek across wide valleys, climb over high mountain peaks, and trudge through thick bogs. Luckily, Garrett can always count on his horse, Roach, to help him in his travels. Well, um, yeah, about that. Roach is really clunky. To have Roach come to double press, which we already did, do a bit of a Yui, and head towards Vesemir. Hold that while moving to Canter. Couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no, because by eating rotting corpses, they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Oh, that's useful. Did you know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him too. His theory collapsed. Double press and hold while moving to Gallop. War is not exactly going Okay, I'm way. thinking I'm gonna run to Vesemir. Yee, tree! Ah! Vesemir, what are you doing? Don't you mean? Ransack village. Once more. your horse's stamina is depleted, Radovid's you can no longer pledge to restore the old Oh, horse. someone's crying back there. Apparently we don't war. care. Believe that. <laughs> Gotta believe something. Yeah, true that. that. Keeps us going. That is very true. Oh, oh, we're stopping back at that building. Sometime later. That doesn't sound good. We going? Nice lighting. Help me! Help! What is it? <gasps> I remember this part. Yeah, isn't that a griffin? God, that is so freaky. Just tearing into the horse right then and there. Get out of it, Roach. Ooh, lovely. Now it's just gonna drip blood everywhere. Vesemir. You're a bit slow there with your dodge. Oh, okay. It just takes the whole carcass. Okay. More bl dripping blood. Don't you use one of your signs against the griffins? Is it like Ard? Or is it Axie to disorient them? I don't remember. What? You definitely use the sign Let's against them when you attack. It's been yeah. so long, guys. Come out. Oh my god, check out the bowl cut on this poor bugger. God, that was close. Who, who cut your sure hair? End up like my mare. Probably for Nobody the better with hair like that. Lucky. Your horse died Look at quickly, it. but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it alive, piece by piece. Uh -oh. Lovely. Oh, the horse is dead. You'd, you'd like a reward, I suppose. I mean. It is my job to do this, so I should expect to get paid, but, I mean, I don't want to be a terrible human being. <laughs> if there was anything, you were in need. We helped. But that's our job! And they call witches heartless. Oh, I am, say trust they me. they won't lift a finger without pay. They also say mice are born of rotting straw. They do? Since Back when? The trail. Like I said, it's because it's 1272, whatever it is. Muddled. You seek someone. I may. Ah, oh, let's not be mean. Yes, a woman, medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No, but there's an inn here in White Orchard. Soul one around. A very definitive gets no. a share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there. White Orchard. Besides, the inn keeps my cousin. Tell her Bram sent you. Bram. She'll treat you like family. Oh, I don't know idea. that I want that, but sure. Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. 
But Blood sure. disagrees. Could use a good rye, nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. Lilac and gooseberries. Go to the tavern in White Orchard. And you introduce me to tea bestiary. On griffins. That's great. I don't want to close it. What is it? Art. Okay, I was right. Knew it was one of those symbols. Griffins. I half eagle, half tomcat, just like on the Lord's crest. Except this one was carrying me dead cow instead of a scepter. Griffin attack witness. Name unknown. Yes, he sounds very cultured. Griffins were once only found on the high mountains, where they would hunt marmots and wild goats. When humans encroached on their lands, however, griffins soon discovered a new source of a much more plentiful and easier caught prey. Cows, sheep, and shepherds. They're still wary of main roads and towns, where folk with the means to hire a witcher would like to dwell. These half-eagle, half-wildcat creatures have gone from rarities to often-counted pests, known throughout the northern realms. Especially hated are the subspecies known as royal griffins and arch griffins. Well, I don't know what kind ours is. Where's Roach? There she is. Hey, girl. Um, excuse me. What part of the uh, cross did you not understand? When on a road, hold cross without steering to automatically follow its. Oh, really? And your horse won't lose stamina while. Go. Okay. Let's just get to the road first, shall we? Oh my gosh, I forgot that was a thing. So, so cool. Griffin this close to the village. Strange. My thoughts exactly. I in the forest to the mountain, sure, but here. Look at the sky, it's so pretty. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. It Thank could be, too. yeah. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. And we should leave as soon as we learn anything. You won't catch me disagreeing. Populated areas. You're nearing a village. Don't disturb the peace. Remember, town guards and hide watchmen won't tolerate theft and also won't look kindly on you accosting others. Yeah, because that's my first instinct. Local residents often erect notice boards near settlements such as villages and cities. These are marked with that on your map. Examine them to learn about contracts, work for witches, and local happenings. They're actually quite entertaining. I mean, yeah, it's where you get your uh, contracts from, but they're quite fun. Slower. Okay, so Gies, you're kind of in the way. Vesemir is about to absolutely squish you. Hold circle to dismount. Oh, it doesn't matter. Cutscene. Is that cat hissing at me? I don't think so. Silly kitty. Yo, watch it, bruh. Oh, great. They're all drunk. What? Take that down before there's trouble. That is your coat of arms, the Temerian lilies. They've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is. Hey guys, what up? What? Witches? What of it? I'll not drink with Weaver Lost Freaks. Well, you can go die from the Griffin. You're more than welcome to. If you don't want my help. I beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm -hmm. Already Gosh, had the pleasure. Gosh, certainly see the wrinkles Ran in her face. The kinsman Bram. Bram? How is he? Was well, good dead horse. Sends his regards. Master witches. Food and drink on the house. Wow. What can I get you? She's nice. I like her. Options marked with that will open the shop menu panel -y thing. Oh, she gave me some roasted chicken legs. Well, that's so sweet of her. Looking for a woman, should we go? Pretty busy place. Pretty busy place you got. Nations on the move. Some search for kin. Others just want to get out of the way of the armies. They all need food, drink, and a night's rest in warmth. So, True war's that. been good for your trade? Aye. 
so far. It'd be best to know peace again. Times like these, you never know what tomorrow will bring. That's true. They're a contract on the Griffin. They're a contract on that Griffin. No, we need pay. Oh, that sucks. sucks. Soon as a beast had built a nest nearby, the Alderman would start a collection or go to the Lord for help. Now but the Alderman don't use the privy without asking uh... the Black One's permission first. And seems they hanged the Lord. Why? For no contract. But Same. I need money. We might have done something. Yeah. Not for free. I need my monies. Looking for a woman. Raven haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white. Riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. I think you yeah, would remember Yen. Especially hard to forget this one. Mm hmm. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folks from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Okay. Sure. Bye. Thanks. For everything. I like the paintings on the wall. It's very rustic, but it does give it a sort of charm that it wouldn't otherwise have. Help you bandage that up? Please. I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask How? about Jennifer. So mm -hmm. where's the fish talking? Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. How did he get hurt? I mean, and don't, don't get me wrong, I know physically the Griffin hit him, but he's wearing chainmail under leather. There's no way the Griffin got through both the leather and the chainmail to strike flesh. That's practically impossible. How? Oh well, that's a problem for another day. Um, I do not want to talk to you, but you guys sneered at me when I walked in, so screw you. Where are we going this way? That's the lady, we just spoke with her, so it must be with her again. More, there are four oh no, is this Gwent? Four? What a waste of time! The earth shall revolve around the sun before you comprehend these rules. <laughs> Got a minute? Why not? Al Dirt Git, assistant professor in contemporary history at Oxenfurt Academy. Oxenfurt, why are you Girl here? Trivia. Witcher with tenure. I'm looking for a woman. Long hair, dressed in black and white. Seen anyone like that? Of course not! Unlike the populace, I know the horsewoman of war is pure poppycock. What? Horseman of war? What do you mean? Horsewoman of war? What's that about? Folks say an omen. A beautiful phantom rides the fields at night, looks as you described her. Armies follow her, and all who cross her path meet with misfortune. That sounds about right. I can vouch for the last bit. <laughs> Know where they saw her? No facts interest me, not fairy tales. Okay. Why are you? Why are you so far from Oxenford? Not a place I'd ever. Because that's up near Novigrad, isn't Taking it? Fleeing the war. Quite the opposite. Chasing it. I'm headed for the front. Tired that's of abnormal. Life. I seek yeah, knowledge, clearly. which I value more than life itself. Oh boy. At first, no dusty old tomes can quench. I At wish to see I the fully understand. Invasion with my own eyes, understand it, and record it all in my chronicle, my magnum opus. Oh, he's one of them. Go back to your books, but I still can. Write about the war, what it's really like. Interesting. We need somebody to describe war, what it's really like. Not colorful banners and generals making moving speeches, but rape, violence, and thoughtless cruelty. Ah, I see you lack the polish of the academy. Um, it's called reality. Rape and are details of no import to the war's course. Ah, uh, yeah, it is. on the garment of conflict, one might say. <laughs> no. Tell that to the people whose houses burned down. Yeah, that's like half of war. It needs to be told. War make it out to Novigrad yet. War reached Novigrad yet? Nope. But it's only a matter of time. Mm. Nilfgaard on one bank, Redania on the other. Drooling over the city like dogs over a juicy bone. I mean, it's a really Many good city. Many rulers choked on that bone. True. We value our liberty in Novigrad, and we know how to fight for it. Mm -hmm. The scholars especially. The sword <laughs> is not the only weapon. Do not forget, architects from our academy designed the city walls. Walls no war machine has ever crumbled. Okay. Bye. Gotta go. So long. 
A moment, Witcher. You strike me as a man. Oh, of the world. it is Gwent. <laughs> Are you familiar with Gwent? No, and I don't have time to learn. No, I do but not. The rules are quite simple. Come no. 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 No, thanks. Got some other things on my mind. I so, am bad at I asked the locals, but since they can't count to ten, the rules are a complete mystery. <laughs> well. Ah, well, I'm here if you change your mind. I mean, sure, but no. I think I played Gwet a total of two times. In the last time I played it through, once with him, and then once, I think as a, a quest compulsory time you've got to play Gwent, or maybe I just optionally did it for a side plot or something, I don't know, but it, it doesn't end well for me. It never does, because I'm not collecting cards as I go through the world, so those battles just don't really work. Gaunt or Dim? Hey, isn't this dude from the one of the DLCs? Um, which one is it? It's the first one. A Heart of, Heart of Stone? Hearts of Stone? I don't know if there's a plural there. Yeah, isn't, it, isn't he in the DLC? It's totally him, because I remember his name. And what he looks like. Uh, like everyone. Not I'm looking like for everyone. a man. <laughs> Not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapses. Schnapses, hey. It'll lift your spirits. Probably. Fine, I'll have a drink. Not in the mood. Let's get to oh, whatever. Sure, why not? Fine, I'll have a drink. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Wait, what? How does he know her name? Well, I suppose if it's Gaunter, that does make sense. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Wish I had that ability. That'd be so helpful. How do you know Yen? Who might you be? How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's palace, oh, of, course. of course. The only way yes, a humble yes. merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. That makes perfect Unless, sense. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. So we did see he her. runs into a very patient witcher. <laughs> it's a Geralt of Rivia himself. The, the butcher, butcher of, Lavigan. of Lavigan. Where, Where's Yen? You see oh, I should have asked who he was. Oh, too late now. But I must ask, is this about love? I mean, we're trying to get some information out of him, so... Guessed it. It's Let's love. not be blunt. I knew it at once. <laughs> what do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark Wait, night. what? She went Black into the Nilfgaardian camp? And... Yes, I know. Why? At a terse exchange with I the don't garrison remember why. Off. Where to? It's kind of weird that I don't remember. <laughs> Neither am garrison. I. But that would likewise be cool. Thanks. Okay, so we've got to go to the Nilfgaardian garrison, where we apparently Yen was. Road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble, and you'll be nearby to help. Ha! Huh. Foreshadowing. He's definitely the one from the hearts of of uh, stone DLC quest updated lilac and gooseberries uh, what do we got here oh that's a storage unit isn't it and there's leaves behind him outside ask enough guardians about Yennefer lilac and gooseberries but that is actually where we may leave the first episode because I think once I leave this building I'm just gonna get epically sidetracked so it's probably safer if I stop playing right here is he eating over there it looks like it was oh no he's playing cards I think he was trying to like tear into a piece of bread with his teeth but no he's just been very focused on his cards 